Hey guys, it's your girl Sydney and I am back with another video. So today we're gonna to be talking specifically about lingerie. The brand is Savage X Fenty, which is Rihanna's brand, her lingerie. First thing I wanna say is I actually ordered this wrong and I have no idea how I messed it up. So this bra probably would have fit if I would have like had the right size, but this is a 38 triple D. I am a 42 G. I can also fit into a 42 triple D, but like a 38, no way in hell. So when you see that clip and I talk about this bra, I'm just gonna mention that. I am plus size, I'm about 300 pounds. So like if we're being really like really legit with what my full weight is, I'm like 294.3 uh, pounds today when I weighed in. Um, I'm 5'9", I'm a 42 G for the most part and a 2X or 3X. Recently I've been buying more 3X. I usually shop at like Adore Me, Shein, Victoria's Secret I really don't shop at right now. So when I'm looking at lingerie, I look for quality, cuteness, and things that actually I would wear and feel good in. Adore Me has been the best lingerie so far. And then now with this review, I'm going to be talking all about what I think. So keep watching. I also will be including clips of what I look like in this lingerie. So if you're curious about my body type um, and how it would fit on you, this video is for educational purposes and hopefully it helps you. We're going to start with this bra. Um, I'm going to insert a clip biggest thing I want to say is it's still very big but my boobs are a lot bigger my waistband size is bigger so this bra is a 38 triple D I don't know if I accidentally ordered the wrong size or if they sent me the wrong size either way I think it definitely would fit and it's beautiful and I'm disappointed that it doesn't so I'm gonna try and return and get the right size but this detailing is so pretty that it makes me sad that it doesn't fit because it's just so freaking cute it has a lot of like really great supportive underwire and the detailing is very high quality. I think it's definitely worth the money. I actually have a membership, like their VIP for Savage X Fenty, and I had been like letting them charge me every month. So the credit that I had on there, I actually didn't have to pay for anything besides shipping and I think like tariffs or something. That's personally what I did. I think it helped, but I'm gonna try and return this one and get the actual size that I need because it's so freaking cute, but it is definitely high quality. And it reminds me a lot of Victoria's Secret's bra that's black with the, the similar ribbing. I used to make videos in it a long 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 time ago it was like definitely one of their push-up bras but this reminds me of that but it doesn't have push-up in it if I had to rate this I would give it an 8.5 out of 10 which is pretty high um the only thing is I think because I'm overweight this wire at the top hurts my arms but other than that it's like really high quality you can tell that it's gonna hold the girls up the straps are very thick and good material so I feel like it's a great bra in general and the cuteness is so freaking cute once you have a bigger chest like me this stuff doesn't usually like come around very often so there's not as many options unless you're trying to like buy custom bras so I really appreciate that they do have my size I just have the wrong size right now this one 8.5 out of 10 I really believe that it is high quality I think it's worth the money and I think it's super super cute makes me feel sexy um and if you see in the clip it just didn't fit but that's because I'm a freaking 42 G and that was a 38 triple D very different sizing uh for the underwear that goes with it I think it's super cute the only thing is it seems to untie really like easily so that's the only thing that's probably typical of anything that is used with ribbon, but I think it's really cute, very flattering. I like the high-waisted part of it because I feel like it held in my tummy and it still made me feel sexy. And I mean, I can wear anything. I wear thongs, I wear all different G-strings, but this just is luxurious. Like it makes me feel like fancy and cute and not too old because it doesn't go up past my belly button. It's like under it still. Um, So it looked really nice and fit really well. The material is awesome. And like I said, this is just something that makes you feel good when sometimes there's not options. This is also in a 2X for the size. So like I said, I'm 2X, 3X. I'm able to fit into a 2X, but if you're ever wavering, definitely size up. But if you're someone that's like, could be in both, but depends on comfort, you know, I definitely would rate, I think a nine out of 10. I think it's awesome. Um, it definitely fits with the bra. And then the next thing that I have is the bralette version. I think it's considered a bralette or maybe a corset. I don't see an official tag, but this one was so freaking cute. The difference is there is not wire in the boob part. So obviously you're not gonna have that oomph that you have with the actual bra, which is why I suggest getting both. Depending on what you're doing, where you're going, what you're wearing it for. This one, I feel like I could actually get away with wearing out in public as a legit top. It is so freaking cute. It comes down to like, right 
right here, just like this top does. I don't know if you can see, but my pants are right here. Um, I personally, because I'm bigger, the side ones do dig in a little bit to my like hip area where my hips kind of come up. That's where this ends, but that's not in my opinion, like an issue with Fenty. That's just a body type thing. Cause like everyone's body types are different and mine just happens to have a little bit extra fat there. As you can see, I think this is very high quality. I think it's really cute. This is something that I would wear tonight. I would wear this ASAP. I think it's beautiful. I think it's high quality. I think it's luxurious. I also like that there's not underwire in the boob part because if it does get uncomfortable for you, it would be annoying to wear, right? Well, there isn't. And then there's also the ribbing and the ribbon, but the ribbing is nice because it holds it in rather than scrunching up in your body and like rolling up. So I really like this style. I like the way that it's built. The straps are very high quality. Everything about it is high quality and just screams sexy, luxury, feel good about yourself. So if you're looking for something and I had to pick one thing on the site to buy, it would be this and then the underwear. And then if you can get the bra too, I would highly recommend it. But this, whew, it's just so like comfortable. I feel like the thing with is what I don't really like wearing bras in general versus I could wear this and be comfy and sexy at the same time. Um, So I do know that this is like a winner for me. It covers a little bit more and it could be a little bit more versatile too for your money. That one's a 10 out of 10. Now, lastly, I have the rope. This rope for me, I personally would rather not spend my money on it. It's not because it's not comfortable. It's just because it slips. So when I have robes, I prefer to wear robes that are going to be less. I like them to be like the material that feels good and like silky, but this one is comfortable and cute, but the problem is it slips off. There's something that's just not, not it. doesn't work with me. I would have to double knot it to get it to stay. If I tie it in a bow, it just slips off. Um, it's a little too silky for like the ribbon and this to be on. And then when it's folded over you like this, it just opens up. And I'm not a huge fan of that. If I'm going to pay for a robe, I would much rather have a plush one that's not going to do that. So I don't really think that's worth the money if that's what you're using it for. Because if I ever open the door, I don't want to be flashing whoever is at the door. And I just, when I'm getting ready, I want to be able to not have to fix my robe a hundred times while I do my makeup or while I'm doing whatever I'm doing. So I personally think the robe is not worth the money. That's probably the worst thing in my haul, but I wanted to try it because there's a lot of robes on the site. So I think it's just the material overall that I don't like about it, just from it slipping and not being secure. And then the bra I probably would love. So I think that these, these lingerie pieces are 100% worth it. I've had pieces from them before and oh, I love them. So hopefully all of this is helpful, makes sense. And yeah, I hope you like this review. I hope you like seeing me try them on. As you can see my body shape, hopefully that is helpful for you. Yeah, I just love trying on lingerie because I have had such a hard time finding lingerie that works for me. I feel like the hardest thing is finding things that make me feel good and sexy. Like you don't want to spend money on lingerie that's uncomfortable, that you're not going to even want to wear and spend a lot of money on it. So I highly recommend these. I would wear them, especially this bra. I feel like on nights where I need support, I would would love to have a bra that is really attractive like this and makes me feel good rather than the ones that I get from Sonoma that are cute enough but don't make me feel like a bombshell. So if I were you, I would recommend getting lingerie, skip the robes, be picky when you're on the site because lingerie is definitely like a personal choice. I love colors. I love wearing things that make me feel pretty. Looking at the details and seeing if you would be okay having this on the side and don't buy everything unless it seems like something that's worth it for you because obviously lingerie is a personal choice and for me I know that like I like to see these reviews to see if it would fit me and make me feel good so hopefully that was helpful hopefully it makes sense I also just wanted to mention really quick if you look at the detail there's the scalloping here of the lace and then there is also a nude piece right here that is super soft so I really think that the detail on the lingerie is amazing I wish I could have gotten my hands on a bodysuit but none of the bodysuits uh were really my style and were something I thought I would even like so I didn't get them if you guys have any other brands you want me to try out, whether they're lingerie or not, let me know in the comments down below. I love testing, trying, and being honest about brands. I paid for all of this with my own money, so none of this is ever sponsored or anything like that because I want to give you guys a real authentic review on these things. I know they're expensive. I know that you work hard for your money, and I know that when I work hard for my money, I don't want to waste it. Hopefully, this video was helpful. Hopefully, this made sense. Hopefully, you liked seeing me try it on. Give this video a like if you want to, and if you're interested in any of my other stuff, you can go to my description and see anything else. I have a ton of other sites that I'm on and I also have other information about me. So I hope that you enjoy and I hope you have a great day. Love you. Thank you for watching. Bye babes.